Hey everyone, Mark again here, Weatherman Plus. I just want to give y'all a tropical update on what we have on all these storms. Uh, if you see on the National Hurricane Center, we have multiple storms. We have Tropical Depression 15, which is forecasted by the Hurricane Center to become Tropical Storm, which would be Tropical Storm Nana, of course. We've been talking about it for days. But as we know, this will weaken and go out. I uh, will show you also uh, what comes with that. But it, it's only showing up to 40 miles per hour winds sustained. Same thing that we're showing with everything else. So this is going away, no problems. Maybe a little uh, current issue on the East Coast. Uh, but that's about it from that. Uh, but this is your storm right here. This is Tropical uh, Depression 15, which will be uh, Nana. And thank God that the name fits. It's just a little old Nana that's going out. Now, I couldn't see uh, too much of a center uh, of this storm to see why they actually gave it a, a, a name because it has to have a center of formation. Otherwise, it's just tropical storm uh, damage and winds on the way. But I think this is your center here, pretty much uh, what you're getting offshore as it goes out right here as well because this is where it gets its, its tropical storm rallies at and it does strengthen up at that point uh, it has a lot of hail but it's going off but thank god there's no problems with it and it is going away so thank you god keep them all away from us we don't want any of them near us and that is your tropical 15. now you also have the one down here that is going by our beautiful uh jamaica and this is your post-tropical uh 16 now this is your 99 l it's now the 16. Uh, it is forecasted to be a tropical storm as well. It's going to get some wind rallies going through. Uh, we'll show you the the water that's coming with it. It's going to miss. Uh, it's going to miss Jamaica. No problem. Might get one section where you get some slight winds on the western side of Jamaica, but that's about it. But as it goes through towards the towards the Yucatan, it curves towards the Pacific, and it gets another strength strengthening of wind rally here towards the end, which I'll show you everything on that. Let me close you out because we don't need you no more. Now here you go on your, your this is all in your pivotal weather. Okay, so you can see your models. This is GFS. This is your dry air right here. All this area right here is dry air. And this is what helped out uh, with Jamaica some. Now if you can't find a low pressure system, you can also find it by the, by the temperature. You can always find it by the, the water amount. And you can see that you have a little storm cell here. This is your post-tropical 16 right here. And then up here we have a little uh, low pressure that forms up over Puerto Rico. Uh, this is your, your heavy rain. But it will get sucked up uh, through towards the high pressure through the Atlantic and go out in the next couple of days. Uh, I got a Euro model to show you that one as, as well. And then you got your other wave that's coming through across right here. Now let me go through the beginning of it. Now you have this the pressure here, you have the tropical depression 15. Okay, this this is gonna be the nana, and this is your Euro model. Okay, this is your Euro model. That way you can see it does go through and it does dissipate and head out on the same path that the other one showed. Now I'm gonna keep this around to show you that the next low pressure that comes around does swing around right here, and this is your Euro model, and it does go head towards Puerto Rico, but like I said, it does head northerly right here and it gets some dry air that cuts in and it gives it a little bit of a path to get up into the atlantic and hopefully go away that's what it seems like it's going to be doing but this is your rainfall amount this is your jamaica right here i wanted to show jamaica that because they need to know what's going on and if you watch the, the this you can also see well let me back it up once so i can show you the one before Now, if you watch this one, you can see the amount and the strength and intensity of this storm. Uh, if you look down here, you'll see the Cape value. Okay, it's, it's at 181 for that section. But if you go a little bit further on the heavy part, and this is the most intensity as far as getting strengthening, 182. So it's got a little bit of, of strength to it. But as it goes away from Jamaica, okay, it does move away. Uh, the strengthening actually does intensify, which clarifies... Uh, the Cape value right here, you have it at 311, which does uh, show true that it does intensify as it heads towards, right here, as it heads out and towards uh, the Pacific. Now, on the Tropical Depression 15, uh, 
me start you in the beginning first. First, this right here, we have a high pressure in the Gulf. These are your wind barbs, and you got the, this is your tropical depression 15, which is going to be the Nana pushing out. But this right here, I wanted to make this point that this high pressure and then the high pressure over Atlantic is making this turn of winds just like this. And that's what's keeping this away from going into the Gulf. It's going to stay below Jamaica. Matter of fact, it's going to turn like you saw. It's going to go southwest. So it is going to go away. There will not be a Gulf from that wave. Now, here's your low pressure right here. It's picking it up on your GFS model. And as you see, it will move through, uh, like, I, like I stated, uh, past Jamaica. It's going to move on out towards the towards Yucatan. Uh, it does get picked up and it weakens and strengthens multiple times because the average is 1,013 uh, out there in the sea. And so it's getting 1,013, it's going to 112, 108, 111, then it's going to 113. But it does move out, as you see, when it finally does organize and decides where it wants to head out. Uh, this is on your Euro model. This is your same uh, pressure system. It just confirms that the path is towards the Yucatan and it will be headed to the out to the west uh, of the Pacific. Now here's your your Nana right here. This is your GFS model. So you can see I'm show you every bit of detail I can get you. It has 1,012 millibars as it confirms that it does move out towards the uh, Atlantic Ocean. And this is your Euro model showing the system right here confirms that it once again does move out to the Atlantic Ocean. Now, when you go to the HRR, your high-resolution radar, it this is your system right here. It confirms as well that as it, as it moves through the Atlantic, it just strengthens a little bit. Uh, you see the center just formed right there. That's where it's going to be called uh, the tropical storm because her National Hurricane Center has it going straight to tropical storm strength, which is the 40. But it does move out into the Atlantic, and then it's not going to curve and hit anybody in the Northeast uh, or the New England states, anything like that. So I do appreciate y'all for watching. Remember, be safe. Nothing's happening with these next couple of waves from what it seems so far, which is a blessing all on its own. Uh, but I'd, I'd like to leave you with one thing, and I'm going to start with 29 of Proverbs and 22. A man given to anger stir, stirs up contention, and anyone disposed to rage has many a transgression. The very haughtiness of earthly man will humble him, but he that is humble in spirit will take hold of glory. He that is partner with a thief is hating his own soul, an oath involving a curse. He may hear, but he reports nothing. Trembling at men is what lays a snare, but he that is trusting in Jehovah will be protected. Uh, many are those seeking the, the face of a ruler, but the judgment of a man is from Jehovah. A man of injustice is something distaste, sorry, detestable, de, detestable to the righteous ones. And one who is upright in his way is something detestable to a wicked one. Amen. God bless you all. I hope you have a great day. Just remember when people hate you and they're, they're doing evil things to you, just bless them and keep on going with your day because like it says, you're just you're doing the right thing. If they hate you, that means that you're, you're, you're showing yourself as righteous. That's why they don't like you. You're not one of them. And that's a good thing. Just like we can see them, they can see us. So God bless you all. Hope you all have a great day. Nothing going on with these waves, guys. We'll be okay. Jamaica, you're okay. Thank you for watching.